Alright everybody, welcome back to the Moffat Project, and today I'm going to be fixing up the uh, bits that are that are left behind, which is one of those things that we need to do, and that is actually fixing this bit of rock, right, right about there, yeah, there, there you go. So we're going to fix this part up, and then uh, we're going to move on to uh, the other side, and then, you know, once the other side is done, then we can finally move onwards to the next trees. Alright, no further ado, let's get started, shall we? So, um, today we will fix this little bit of mess that I left behind and uh, hopefully that will actually work out quite well. So, the first thing we need to know is how do we get from point A to point B? Well, the first point that we need to do is get this up uh, so that it is no longer uh, too much of a shady business. So we're going to be looking for uh, the part that we are looking for. So that's the first thing that we need to look for. So not this. And this, yes, this is it. And then we need to look for, systematically, we need to look for the thing that we need to look for. So, no, no. That's up. That's down. No, that is the rocks. We don't want to go for the rocks. We want um, we want the other part of the rocks. So it should be here, right? Then should be here. No, is then this one in total? No, it's not. It's this one in total. So it should be then one of these things. Uh, nope. Nope, nope, nope. Yes, all right, good. Which part is it? Nope, nope, nope. Yes. All right, we're almost there. This is the part that we need to remove. Or at least, you know, we need to fix this so that it doesn't look too much of a problematical issue. So what we want to do here is we're going to be implementing the grass as uh, stated before. We're going to implement the grass, we're going to put it here as well, and then up it with some uh, tree pods so that you know it looks nice. So that's what we're going to be doing. So we're going to be leaving this, uh, this part around behind, so we're going to be removing this bit right here, this bit right there, and this bit right here. Yes. All right. Now, uh, we want some drawing right here, so we need to fix this up. So this is all behind the rocks, as you can see. It's all behind the rocks right there. It's all behind it. Lovely. But first, we need to grab the pencil that we need, and then we need to go right to 3.6. So, we want to continue with the grass that we have right there. We have all the grass that we want. We want this grass to be everywhere that we need to be. So, around here until here, we want the grass. Yes, all right. Like that, right? Yes, right that. So that's the first thing, and then we need to make sure that we have that part up and running. So we want this, and then we want that. All right, and now we need to fix the bits. Up. Now we need to add another layer down. Uh, this layer needs to be gone underneath this. This is a one layer that we need, and two layers do we need, because we need the grass and we need the wood, so that's different layers. And by doing this, we should be able to pull it off properly. No, that's not the grass I wanted. We wanted to have the good grass, yeah, there you go. 
And then we also need to make sure that we have this part right there. All right, so we need to fix this bit up now. That's that's possible. That's not a problem. Um, and then we also now need to make sure that we have the the thing right there. So we're gonna pick up a color, and we're just gonna color it in like that. Boom. That yeah, would work. That would actually work. That would actually be believable, right? Yeah, it does. All right. Now that we've done that, uh, we need to figure out where that is laying around. Because apparently we have some empty stuff that needs to be fixed. Um, no. No. Yes. Now the question is... Oh. Ah. Mushrooms. Ah, the mushrooms. All right. Yeah, we're casually removing some bits here in the nooks and crannies. There you go. It's more better. Now we do have the mushrooms that we need. All right, good. We fixed that, and now we can continue. Uh, we were, we were, were we, we were, we were here, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. First things first. We need to make sure that this looks nice. Like that. Good. That is too much. We want a little bit more lighter, and we're going to be removing that to this one. Lower the size a bit. That's too much. It will work, but it doesn't work too much, so we need to go a little bit more deeper. There you go. And a little bit more darker on the sideways. Like right here, we need to be a bit more darker. And once we've done that, we can then move onwards towards the bits that we want, which is getting that. Now we're going to lower the size even more. And now we're just gonna be at, now we're just gonna be giving our grass a little bit of a highlighting. All right, should that fix it? It does. Um. This needs to be a little more heavier. Or oh, that part is not fully correct. That's supposed to be representing tall grass. Hmm, I see. Now oh, then we need to fix this instead. Alright. Yeah, it's important that we do this. If we don't do this, then the whole drawing will look weird. So I'm going to be drawing from there. Yep. So, like this. Tall grassy.
That actually works. Nice. I like it. So now we have tall grass instead of long grass. Now we need to fix it up here, though. Ugh. Now we need to fix this tall grass there so that it looks the same. Got it. All right. Do we need lighting, lighting there? No, we don't. Good. And now we need to look for the thing that we are working on before. Which are... Uh, no. No, no. There you go. And now we can work on this part. Yes. Now we need to look... Yes, now we need to work on this. Ugh, we need to rearrange some bits here. And that's going to be the painful thing to do. So, what what is happening here? Um, allow me to have a clean explanation on this. Uh, the grass is not fully correct. And that can happen, you know. It can happen that the grass is not fully correct and therefore, you know, it is too rough on the side, probably. Or too rough on the edges. One of the things. But we do want to make sure that this is properly working anyway. So how do we do that? Well, we're going to be just redrawing. So... And then start our way upwards. All right. I went a little bit too quick on the uh, grass, it seems. That's why I'm now doing it. And not yesterday. Now we can profit about it. All right. Now, uh, now we have done that, we can now move onwards. So I'm going to draw it again. And then also we need to uh, get the color of the grass in the right proper coloration. Oh boy. That is a thing that can happen, you know? Because we want this grass to be looking like the grass that we had before. Therefore, you know, giving it more of a leeway. So if you now look at this. That looks much better. And then we can still go for the loose grass, but we now need to make sure that we have this color in there as well. Uh, that is this one. And then we need to fix that into this color right there. And why do we need to have this color? Well, it's because of the amount of bullshit that it's going to be pulling every dot. So, we're going to be just coloring it up, just like that. No longer is it too sharp. And now it has the same color as the rest, finally. Now, though, we need to fix the bits and the nooks and crannies, that's for sure. Right. Now we need to gently remove the bits that we need to remove. It's too much. We want six properly. 
And once we're doing this, we're gonna be casually, you know, or how do you say that? We do this at time at time, you know. Sometimes grass can be a pain in the ass to do because, well, the the issue lies always with how the grass works. Sometimes, you know, when you draw the grass, uh, you don't always have the same result as always. And you need to improvise. That's why I always like grass. It always gives a challenge with it. Sometimes you get the grass correctly and sometimes you don't. Most of the cases, you know, when once you have the grass correctly, then, you know, you will fail at drawing it again. Same goes for the rocks. So the idea is to make sure that even if you make it a little bit wrong, it doesn't mean that it have to be perfect, but it, you should definitely try to compensate for it sometimes. Try to fix it a bit so that it does uh, look gentle and, and so that it does look nice enough to trans, uh, trans, late trans, uh, so that it goes to the other side properly. Like for instance right now, because we have too much black in that area, we have now grass instead. And that grass will fix, uh, will fix a lot of issues. Because we have a rock right there that is representing, that is coming up what's here. And we have some rocks there, here and there. And we could even place another rock right here if we want to. To fill up the problems that it had leaving behind. But by the looks of it, this is still tiny grass though. And we'll be working well enough, I think. Especially if you don't look too closely. Well, normally people will look closely on these things, so... I will try to get myself to see if I can get it done by coloring. And then see if I fixed it. Therefore, I will not work on this one. I will work on... I will try to work on the... Uh, There you go. Now we're gonna go for this, and we're gonna go for putting them there. Yeah. Go. All right. What? Oh, I did not press that button. God dang it. Sweet. Now we can take a look at this. Does it look the same? That's the question. No, because it's missing... ...clustering. Huh. Alright. This is why it's important to always check. So even if we have this, we now know that that is not enough. So we will erase this. This is why it is actually quite important to do anyway. So we have erased this and now we can start over again and now we need to make sure that we cl uh, cluster it. By clustering it, it should work.
the main issue with clustering is though that it does require a little bit more strokes to work around with but it will give us the idea that we wanted a smooth steady transition from point a to point b and yes there will be some bits that might be a little bit more out of the ordinary that's what I'm now doing adding some variety in there to create some long grass to go from short to long even though you know it's all clustered anyway come on yeah there you go so to create this cluster effect it will uh, require you to just you know to press make some hookies like this like draw a little tooth and that's it draw little tooths make sure that the tooths are you know in a kind of line in a kind of wave around the object you should be fine the main issue I have now is that I need to uh, fix the rest of it as well. Bleh. That is going to be the main problem. But it does work right. It does give us the look that we wanted in the first place. Yes, it does give us the realization of the same thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, good, 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 good. Of course, you want some variety in there, otherwise you're going to be a little bit iffy on the things sometimes, but uh, there you go. This is going to be a pain in the ass to color though, but it should fine now, it should work. Does it translate better? It does translate better, good. Uh, yes, it works, good. Now we need to find out how to get this to that. Oh boy. Because these are two different drawing styles. And that's the main problem. And the main issue. I think that's the better word for it. So. To make sure that that is working properly. We should definitely fix that then. But first, let's fix this. Because if we fix this, a lot of it will be fixed later on. So... Uh, let's see, that's a way too big. That's a good enough one. All right. And then that should fix that. It did. All right. Well, what I do for just, you know, a little bit of drawing. But it is necessary to get it all up and running properly.
I mean, that should be it then. Yes. So if we now look at this. If we now look at this. It transists better. Yes, it does. Now it needs only highlights a bit, and then that should be it finally. All right. Doo -doo. There you go. Highlights, eh? Hey? Um, yes. So it needs some highlights. All right, nice. So now we have the thing that we wanted. Now the question is, how do we fix the other part? <laughs> well, you're not gonna like it, but we need to fix this bit now up. Ah, all right. We've put some grass there. All right. Now when you add that also there, so let's do that right now. That's the wrong color. Yes, almost. That will work. Whew. So hot, this one. The main issue here is that this is actually quite difficult to pull off most of the times. Oh, really? First, we need to color it in, and then we need to erase all those things that we don't want. All right. Mm. 
Yes. And then this should be finally the right translation towards the thing that I wanted to do in the first place. Alright, let's see, double check, yes it does work, alright, good. Um, now we do need some lighter colors there. There you go. That should be it, right? Now let's see if we zoom out. Does this fix it? Yes, it does. Oh, thank God. Thank God it fixes. Oh, yee, yee, yee. That is some difficulty right there. Ugh. Fixing goddamn grass. All right. Mm, let's see how much time did we do this on? Half an hour. All right, good. Good, 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 good. So what did we do? We fixed, uh, we fixed uh, the left, uh, the left part. We fixed that. We put some more rocks down. Uh, we put, uh, we put some rocks. We put a rock right here. We put another rock right there. We put a rock right there. On top of this rock right here so what happens is we have multiple rocks here we have some layers and then we have another rock right here and then implement that implements that there is some more rocks that coming around this way so now we have fixed this part yeah right yeah 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 it's that i cannot uh, yeah, we could, we could, we could technically move this rock right there. Therefore, if we do that, if we move this rock a little bit to the left and put it down like that, would that fix it? Would it fix the bit of livability? No, it does not. Uh, d -d 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 yes, 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 yes. All right, good. So it's still good enough. Yeah. So today we're going to be uh, trying to see what we want to do here. So let's see where that tree lies. So this is a tree. Yes. We want this tree to be up front here. So this is the layer where we want to work here then. This is the rock layer. And we want to work here. So we're going to make a rough sketch right about here. All right. So how do we gonna fill this up? Because we wanna fill this whole bit up. We want this bit filled up till brink until here. So we want some grass right there. Want some grass right there, some grass right here. And if we then move this to here, some more ideas, we can then connect it to, right? 
Yes. We can connect the two by doing that. But this needs to be a little more upwards, so it needs to be a little more hectic. So it doesn't screw me over in perspective wise. Right there. Yes. That's better. So we want this, we want that, we want some grass right there. And we want to fill this up to the brink with grass. And then once we have the grass done, that fills up this space right here. We then want to add some rocks in, so we're going to put some rocks in. Uh, we're going to do that with the original drawing. So we want to put some rocks down, so we want to put a rock right here for instance i'm gonna put a rock right there i'm gonna put a rock right here because we can have some rocks tiny rock and then we want we want this bit to be overlapping right here so we want this to be there and then add in there some more layers on top some more rocks, some grass. Take care. So what is this? Uh, let's see if we can do that. Is this rock? Is this rock able to connect? Um, let's see, yes, it does. Yes, it does. All right. So what this rock is all about is just you know this. This is the rock. It's all about you know amplifying tiny brush strokes right here and then go smooth on the top so it's a it's a different rock type it's more you know more smoother i think yeah more smooth so this rock right here can then be added in uh i believe it needs to be in this color so we're gonna pick up that color right now so if we then you know add a color layer to it should be fine we should have like this to be uh this is supposed to be a rock right here right there needs to be a color rock right there needs to be a color rock right there needs to be a color rock and then we can you know add it in another rock right there Another rock right there needs to be drawn in. And I'm just drawing it very sketchy, but I want to know what hell I need to draw these rocks. Because it does make sense to make rocks. It's just a little bit, a bit hard sometimes. And no, we're not going to do the charcoal experience. No, we need, we need to make sure that these rocks are decent. Looking. Um. So what we're going to do then... So if we have these rocks right there, uh, let's add some more stuff to it. Uh, I think I'm going to have to go with white on this one. So we could add some bits right there. We could add some mushrooms if we want to. I think that would be an excellent idea. You know, make some mushrooms happening. Uh, red ones. Yeah, let's go for some red mushrooms. So we're going to go for some mad mushrooms right there. Like big ones, big ones. So we want to make a mushroom right there, mushroom right now, because otherwise it wouldn't make any sense. But if you have some mushrooms that are laying around, that's always good. Uh, and then we also want another tree done, another vern done. So we want a vern right here, going upwards right there. With some leaves pointing this way and then you know the leaf parts need to go this way there you go so now we have some verns in there as well and that gives us more depth. Hmm. Not too bad. 
does fill up all the stuff that we want and we want to make sure that it is not always everywhere that the, 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 the not supposed to be everywhere the same thing you know but we do want to make sure that this grass looks nice I did something here didn't I I did something here with my hand here I removed a layer seems all right Closed off something here, so we don't need this anyway. So this is not the thing we want. It's the background. This is the part. All right, we closed off something here. Mm. Hmm. Ah, there it is. Whew. All right. Oh, that was a little bit risky. Gonna be saving this up. And now we can already see where we want to go for. So this is the tree. No, this is the tree bit. No, that's the Martha part. That's the grass idea and these are the three ideas that I made for so with this idea we are going for a background drop that goes upwards no no we don't want that we want to go sideways on this we want to go this way into it all right I think that's it for today uh, we did actually made a lot of progress we fixed oh wait hold on 50 minutes for uh, 20 minutes left so i can still fix this then i see that there is a mistake and we are making mistakes and therefore we need to fix them always happens you know fixing mistakes seeing mistakes happening it happens and there's no way around it most of the time Yes, so we need to be here then. Uh huh. Well, we can place it here. Ah, no, uh, that's not what I want. No, 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 yes, 
Yes. Yes. It's always so confusing. Yes. All right. Now we can work on it. What the hell? Asking, I was asking for this color and it doesn't show me the right way. And then we need to go for darker colors. Uh, there you go. Yes. All right. Saving this bad boy. Woo. Dodge the bullet there. All right. So as you can see, we fixed the goddamn uh, picture right now. Uh. Eh. Uh, it's one bit that I don't like. And that is right there. So we're gonna make it a little bit darker. Because why we would uh, do that, it's because of this shenanigans right there. Yes, and now we need to go making sure that that is not properly done. Like so, yes, alright. Now we're saving it. Alright, good. Now it's not in... Now it's not inconsistent. Yes. Ugh. So, that's it for today. Um, I hope you all have enjoyed uh, me getting frustrated on this. But uh, I hope you all, uh, all have a lovely day. And I hope we'll see you all next time. Until then, I want to wish you all a lovely day. 